John Paul Jones, how did you deduce that? <laughs> Guess that it's probably not good. Okay, wait, let's talk about last night. Oh man. All right, we're gonna quickly, in maybe 20 to 30 seconds, give a summation of last night's episode. You ready? Ready. It started off with a fight that could have ended Christian's life. He could have seriously broken his head. Then Christian and Jordan get kicked off. Then Hannah decides to give the rose to Dylan. Blake's like, what? And Christina gives it to Blake. So ABC cam is gone, Wills is gone, yep, and Kevin. Then Caitlin arrives, you might remember her as the, I'm gonna pop your cherry from Colton's season with the red balloon. And she picks Blake for a date. Dylan opens up, tells Hannah about his dad being diagnosed with cancer. And then tells her that he's falling in love with her. And she says, I'm, I'm all in. in. <laughs> then Tasha and John Paul Jones have this hilarious interaction back and forth. I love when he was like, Tasha Paul Jones. But then he goes over to the side of the pool and he does a snot rocket and it really made me want to vomit. We find out Demi's girlfriend's name is Christian. Yeah. Hannah shows up to talk about Christian to Demi and Demi then wants to talk to Chris Harrison. Dun, dun, dun. And that brings us up to right now. Let us begin episode six of Bachelor in Paradise. <laughs> How are What's you? What's going on? Look at all the like, looky loos. What's happening? <laughs> oh. I bet in traffic they all slow down when there's an accident. <laughs> What's going on? Oh, I thought that was Chris's voice. I was like, what happened so to what's going on? <laughs> I feel so, like, not involved in it at all, though. That's because you're not, old man. It's just hard to know that there is another person there. I watched with my husband last night. He was like, of course he doesn't care because there's no ego involved when it's another woman. Uh, when it's not another man, there's not, like, that ego, like, mm, me man, me must conquer woman. It's like, oh, that's fine. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah. So before I came to Paradise, I have been dating this woman. Okay. Like, this is the first time Chris has heard of it. I mean... Okay. Mm. <laughs> okay. Mm. Interesting. I didn't know that when I signed you up for the show. Did you see the battle between yes. Tanner and, and Demi? Demi? I thought she shot back a little too harshly. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That was a little it bit. It was aggressive. And he stayed sort of the high road with it, which... I can see both their points, I mean. Mm -hmm. Oh, and later I'm gonna give a post-pregnancy belly update. Now it's two and a half weeks, I think. Something like that, so stay tuned if you care. Did he have something in his mouth? I think so. <gasps> but he tried to stop chewing. Uh-huh. Yeah. Frankly, she's probably going through so much more than I am. He is a really good guy. He is, but is this, is this real? I don't know. Was it premeditated, pre-planned? Good. Question, Rye. Hmm. Because I feel like Chris at any moment is gonna be like, well, the good news is, is she's, she's on her way. Yeah. But yeah. thanks for just telling me. Thanks for trusting me. Ow. I'm so sorry. God, I was like, are you Zach Morrising me right now? What's happening? I support you. I will take you any way you come. Whoa, Chris. Oh. They didn't invite you into the bedroom, dude. Seriously. The claw. The claw. Oh. Goodbye, son. That <laughs> son looks just like Hannah G's butt when they edited out her crack. How's this thing going? Mm. <laughs> That's all I get. <laughs> no, I said good. I said good. I didn't go eh. I said good. Rewind the tape. Rewind the tape. Mm. Good. I just don't understand why he's giving her the time of day. Like, he's given every woman there the time of day. Hello. She gives me Khaleesi vibes. Oh, a little bit, a little bit. <laughs> Is something in her teeth? I can't get over it. Right here. It's like she just ate some fajitas and a big old pepper is stuck. Chill. I'm not no, saying I'm that. No, I'm not going to chill, honey. I'm not going to chill, spasiba. In walks Jen Saviano, who in my opinion is one of the most beautiful girls in all of Bachelor Nation, if not the entire planet Earth. Wow, Dean. She kind of looks like um, Olivia Munn. Munn. He was hanging out with her at Stagecoach? Mm -hmm. I mean, what is this? They all go to stagecoach and just hump each other? Yes. That is exactly what happened. Oh my goodness. Like what you just said like this morning, like... Threw you off? What's that? Threw you off? Yeah. Okay, I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. Please don't go. I know. <laughs> she was like thinking she was being like a cool chick by saying that. Exactly. And I was totally bitten her in the ass. Dylan's like, I would never say that to you. Exactly. I live right in this armpit. <laughs> I don't want this to like degress what we have. Degress? You wanted to bring you more clarity? Yes. That's okay. okay. I wanted to bring you more clarity too. She's falling back into the trying to be the cool girl. Mm -hmm. And then she's gonna cry when he leaves. All she has to say is, ah, I really wish I shouldn't have said that. Please don't go. She's not gonna do that. Mm -mm. It is annoying. 
Did she say it's snowing? Nope. What did she say? She said, he's got a little ween. <laughs> <laughs> I just f all up. <sighs> I can't. With her crying? With the crying and she just was like, yep, sounds great. Okay, bye. Hope you get clarity. <gasps> I can't believe I did that. What are you doing? They're on the ball! They're on the ball! <laughs> oh, that was the bird talking. Yeah. Okay. Wow, that feels real good, Chris. God, that's horrible. <laughs> that's like Demi's. <laughs> Remember Demi's massage for Colton? <laughs> Wouldn't you like to come home to this? Are they not allowed sunglasses? Because nobody's wearing sunglasses. I was literally just thinking that. I guess not. Katie, I love you, but I don't like the side of you. They're on a boat! Come on, they're on a boat! <laughs> I'm going to report to Katie! I thought she had a black bar. I thought that was an edit. Oh, can you imagine? <laughs> That's part of the suit. I don't like that. <laughs> Nothing says romance like a little upchuck. It was a terrible date. Oh, hey, guys. <laughs> hey, guys. That's her shield. <laughs> Hello. Oh, wow. This is called the Boom Boom Room. <laughs> Welcome. Meet me, meet me. I see you, Chris. I know what you're doing. I think he doesn't know if, how much I like him. How are people allowing her to talk this long about this? Know. As your friend, Katie, I would say, stop. Let's go have a drink. Relax. Let's go look at the freaking crabs. Mm-hmm. In Blake's crotch. What? <laughs> Jeez, I didn't. She scared me when she started going down. <laughs> I know you always wanted to hear me sing. Yes. Oh, Jesus. Huh? Your biceps are so yummy. What's happening? No words. But um, bum <laughs> Oh. She's got balls for doing that. We'll give her that. Super uncomfortable. And his reaction, oh, yeah, okay. Mm. Okay. Mm. Oh, okay. <laughs> no. Uh -huh, I saw it all. We just got to make it out. I won't show you my lips because there's lipstick on them still. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if that is like a little subconscious like, it was fine. Didn't use these. <laughs> oh my God. Why did they do that to him? I don't know. He loves tacos. <gasps> is she holding Dylan? <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> She's tall enough to that do that. That makes so much sense though. Like, that I, cause I feel like he's hilarious. just such like a little sweet man. Hold me, Hannah. We're going to tell Christian everything. <laughs> hey guys. Hi. Hi. What does that mean? It's a greeting. It's a normal American greeting. It means, hello there. It's interesting to see you. <laughs> do you think the franchise is exploiting this relationship a little bit? Or are they trying to make a turn as a franchise into being more open to? I think that they're using it as a way to be more inclusive, but also exploit it a little bit. Okay. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like she probably wanted to, to bring a little more awareness to LGBTQ mm -hmm. and they were probably like, yeah, let's do that. Okay. You know, look at that tattoo. Agape love. I believe that's like a biblical... <laughs> we just looked it up. Agape is considered to be the love originating from God or Christ for humankind. So, it's an all-inclusive, all-accepting love. Agape I love, love it. My name is Christian, and I'm 27 years old. I thought she was older than 27. I know. I'm getting a mom-daughter vibe, and so I'm So am I. It. Derek, he is amazing. She said he was amazing? Mm -hmm. Past tense already. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I feel like probably one a huge fear for a woman in a relationship with a woman would be a man coming in. Yes, probably. But no matter what gender, just letting your person go and explore anybody else would be mm -hmm. hard, obviously. You are super, super amazing. You're the best dude on this beach, like hands down. With that beginning, nothing good can come no, after that. Not even a little bit. Um. Lord, she's shaking. I'm gonna pursue my relationship with her here. With her here? Mm, that's weird. That's so weird. Nightmare. Uh-huh. Nightmare on Nayarit Street. 
<laughs> Is that what it's called where they are? No idea. <laughs> I really want him to be happy and I hate that I'm making him so unhappy right now. Why does this not feel real to me? Mm. Does it feel real to you? Am I just a stone cold biatch? I think it's real. You do? Mm -hmm. I don't think that's very fair or nice that they're staying. There's I don't literally either. no point. She's like, I choose you. Because she wants go. to get engaged on the show. I know. So this... I don't agree with this, producers. Maybe, maybe Tanner was onto something. Mm-hmm. It's not about you. It's about me and... I, I know that. I mean, he did handle that incredibly gracefully. He's handled the entire situation gracefully. Everyone always says, oh, you're a great guy. I don't want just that. I don't want to just hear that. Who is he talking to? I hope, I hope a person and not the Dean's mustache above him. <laughs> what is she holding? Is she with a vape? Yep. Ugh. Oh, God. This is going to be like self-flagellation. There's like nothing more that I would want than for you to stay here and pursue a relationship with me. I want to be with you. You want to be with me. But let's stay here and figure out what we want. Explore. Explore. I think they had a little script issue with this storyline here. <laughs> There's no script, okay? I know. I don't know who this woman is. Where'd she come from? Where did she come from? Where did she go? Got <laughs> Nacho. He's like, did I did I meet her at stagecoach? <laughs> Was I inside her at any point? Oh my god, she's like holding a conference. Poor Derek. I love that she came out, that she's got this great relationship, that she's in love. I love all of that. Mm -hmm. But get out of paradise. I know, that's... Does anyone else not care about this date? You included. I don't. <laughs> you're, you're sitting here with me, you can answer. <laughs> I knew you would go on dates and everything, but to hear that, like, someone else had those moments with you, it was, yeah. like, it was a lot. So she was prepared for her to go on dates and stuff, but not to like really get feels. This has to be scary for Christian too though. I mean, even if she's out to everybody in her life, coming on and putting yourself in this vulnerable situation mm -hmm. with like millions of people watching and judging and that's hard. It is. I know it's a crazy like <laughs> thing to think that I figured all that out here. That is crazy and that is hard to believe. Hmm. Tanner, what do you think? I want to spend it with her. I can't see it being like anybody else, ever. Next week on Bachelor in Paradise. I've been waiting for Dean to screw me over. We have every right to be worried. Will Dean show Kaylin his true colors? From what I know about this business, <laughs> his question, the way that they teased that, where she said, I've been waiting for him to screw me over, and then will he screw her over? The answer is no, mm -hmm. he will not. I'm confused because John Paul Jones was so into Tasha, but now new meat arrives and... So that was one of the twins, right? Mm -hmm. One of the twins and then Tajwan, who we believe was in Colton season. Nicole is an interesting person. <laughs> okay. That singing number was just strange. Oh, yeah. Um, That's what you took away from this whole episode? No. Was Nicole's song and no, dance routine? I'm trying to go over what happened outside of the obvious. Demi's girlfriend shows up. They're gonna stay, so that'll be fun. It won't be fun for Derek. Um, oh, poor Derek. Ugh. Yeah. Christian seems cool. Mm hmm She seems like a real nice gal. Even last week, I thought it was a little odd if roles were reversed or if it was a male-female relationship. Everyone would freak out and say, go home. Yeah. Um, but from, I don't believe she is like Jed from the fact that she hasn't lied to anybody. She was upfront with Derek. She told him, this is where I am. I do yeah. have someone home. Like she's been very honest throughout the whole process. So that's... And with Christian, she was honest. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I feel like not Jeddish. However, similar behavior as far as having someone home. Yeah. It's been real and it's been fun. It has been real fun. Our dad used to say that at the end of every swim meet because he was always the MC and I was always like, I don't know you. <laughs> anyway, hit subscribe if you haven't yet. If you have, thank you. And we'll see you guys next week.
Bye. But wait, here's my stomach update. Oh yes. So we are uh, two and a half weeks out from baby. And uh, this is where we are. You like my white shorts? Don't make fun of me, people. Come on, I'm just going <laughs> for comfort. So yeah, there's still a belly there. But that's what happens. I think you look fabulous. Well, thanks. She has to say that. All right, we'll see you guys next week. Uh-oh, baby's hungry. Is he awake? No. The baby's still sleeping. <laughs>